Liverpool. Delighted to start the new year with a new signing. Musa Bakayoko has joined the club. Yeah, it was. Uh, it came out of the blue, really. We got a, a phone call uh, from his agent a couple of days ago, just saying that he'd left Dartford and uh, he was looking for uh, looking for a club. Um, it's someone that I'd seen play for Dartford a couple of times from you know when we'd watched Dartford prior to playing them, and you know we uh, we felt we needed uh, to add in that wide department that little bit of uh, pace and trickery. And uh, as I said, Moose's you know Moose has joined us, and uh, I think it's going to be a, a good signing for us. I suppose it says a lot about us that we've quickly attracted one of the, the key talents in this league. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't know the reasons behind his, you know, uh, departure at Dartford too much. It's just say we got we got the, the agent just said he, he wasn't happy for for some reason, uh, and he was looking to join a club certainly that trained mornings. But also I think uh, logistics had a lot to do with it. You know, he lives in Farnham, which is only half an hour from here, forty five minutes. Uh, obviously, we got a couple of players who live close to him, so the whole thing just seemed to to marry up quite well and you know we, we just uh, had a good session today his first session with us and um, yeah he looked you know he, he looked decent to be fair he looks as if he's the sort of player that suits the way we play quite well doesn't he, he compliments us yeah and I felt we needed just needed one more a attacking threat certainly in the wide areas you know Lucas and uh, Lucas and Daniel still quite young and still learning the game uh, and obviously at the moment we've really only got Rory so you know by bringing Musa in it adds competition we've now got sort of four wide players as opposed to only having three um, we are looking you know we're looking for him to certainly try and push the start for us as opposed to being one that we need to develop too much and of course as well knowing the month ahead 10 games in a month we always needed the, the strength in numbers yeah I mean and you know and the other thing is I'll be honest about it he's uh, you know he, he wanted to come uh, it's not an expensive signing whatsoever and you know it's an opportunity to put him in a window for him you know I think he's got aspirations as most players do to, to go on to, to higher levels so for us it was a bit of a no-brainer you know it was uh, say very little money really to, to add him to the squad and he's already shown his, his real quality this morning so you know like I say he's, he's um, you know it's a good addition he's uh, it, it'll, it'll add to what Rory brings it also means I can bring Josh Taylor more into the middle when I need him to so for all, all sorts of reasons, it was just a, it was a good phone call to get at probably the right time. And of course, he's a player that knows the level quite well, having come from Dartford. How much does that help you knowing that he knows the levels, knows the demands, knows the expectations, the way games are played in this league? Very important. I think that um, you know I watched him uh, away at Chippenham, which is if you can play well at Chippenham on a Tuesday night on a difficult pitch. Uh, watched him in the Slough Trophy game, and obviously I saw him for half an hour against us before he he did his hamstring. Um, as I said, our, how we're going to use him is slightly differently. You know, he won't be he won't be a second striker here. I don't think uh, it'd be more coming as an attacking third player uh, in the wide areas. So, I think that will suit him. Uh, we'll certainly give him the platform to go and play. But I think the other thing he wanted was to get back to daytime training, um, closer to home. Uh, you know, for his training. Uh, and you know, I think he'll enjoy it here. I think the professionalism of the club. You know, the, the way he gets looked after. Um, you know, even people going to pick him up from his home to bring him in all these little touches I think have made a, have made him want to come as well so you know like I said it was got we got it over the line today um, and it's just one that we weren't really expecting we weren't really looking for but as I said it was a phone call that took place and we were happy to bring him in as long as if the stars aligned on this one absolutely yeah cool. thank you very much cheers Henry